Welcome everyone to the Fastlane pay-per-view. And what a night it's shaping up to be. We've got a blockbuster match for the WWE Women's Championship as Liv Morgan challenges the formidable Bayley, who as always has her numbers game in full effect on with Dakota Kai and Io Sky. Ah, uh, and here comes Liv Morgan, making her way to the ring, focused and determined. You can feel the intensity in the air. Liv's got that look in her eyes. She's not here to play games. She's here for championship gold. And now, here comes the reigning and defending WWE Women's Champion, Bayley. Accompanied by her cohorts, Dakota Kai and Ayo Sky, the champion exuding confidence as she makes her way to the ring. Bayley looks like she's in her element. She's got the gold around her waist, the numbers game in her favor, and a smirk that says, I own this place. The stage is set, the champion is in the ring, and the WWE Women's Championship is on the line. Liv Morgan versus Bailey. It's about to go down at Fastlane. And here we go, folks. The bell has rung, and Bailey wastes no time, charging at Liv with quick stomps in the corner. Liv, though, not backing down. She fires back, rocking Bailey. Liv's got some fight in her, Michael. She's not here to play games. She's here for that championship. Both women trading blows in the center of the ring. This is turning into a real slugfest, Corey. And that's what you love to see, Michael. Both competitors leaving it all in the ring for that coveted women's championship. This match is far from over. Liv Morgan has been holding her own, but you can't underestimate the impact of that numbers game, Corey. Dakota Kai and Io Sky on the outside, providing a constant distraction. Absolutely, Michael. Liv's got to keep her head on a swivel. It's like fighting a, uh, a two-front battle with Bailey and her allies. Dakota getting involved again. The referee must stay alert. Bailey seizing the opportunity here. Liv momentarily distracted, and Bailey takes advantage with a surprise roll up. She might steal the match right here. We are in the end game now. Liv Morgan and Bailey going all out for the title on the line. Oh my goodness. Liv Morgan with a burst of energy pushing Bailey right into the referee. And the official is down. And look at this. Dakota Kai taking advantage of the situation, blindsiding Liv with a cheap attack. The numbers game strikes again. Bailey now signaling her allies to revive the referee. Lives down and out, and the official is starting to count. Bailey retains the WWE Women's Championship in controversial fashion here at Fastlane. Liv Morgan gave it her all, but the numbers game and a well-timed distraction proved to be too much. Bailey might not have won this match on her own, but she's leaving Fastlane with that women's championship still around her waist. Liv's got to be devastated after coming so close. I am sure this is far from being over. Liv Morgan learned a lesson today, but she will come back stronger. Last week, I stepped into the ring with Tiffany Stratton, a powerhouse in her own right. It was a battle, a war. And in the end, I stand before you as your NXT Women's Champion. Now, there's something we need to address. Tegan Knox, you tried to cash in that Money in the Bank contract on me after the match. A valiant effort, but you know what they say, Tegan? Not today. I am a fighting champion, and I'll face anyone who steps up. Tegan, you're a formidable opponent. But if you want this championship, you'll have to earn it. No shortcuts, no surprise cash, ins. Let's do this the right way. What about me? Gigi, I've got to give credit where credit is due. You've got this fire, this passion, and an intensity that's hard to match. Yeah, and you talk too much. Why don't you put that shiny belt on the line and prove you are the rightful champ? We clashed in the ring before, and it was nothing short of explosive. Unfortunately, our last encounter got tainted by unwanted interference. JC Jane, you may have tried to cast a shadow over that match, but let me make something clear. That wasn't the end. It was just a detour. Gigi, you and I, we have unfinished business. I like your spirit. I like your fight. So here's a proposition. Let's do it again. One on one. No outside interference, no distractions. Just you and me in that squared circle. I am sure everyone here wants it. As far as I am concerned, you've earned another shot at this NXT Women's Championship.
Let's settle our differences the right way, under the bright lights of NXT, with the world watching. Gigi, let's make it happen. I want to beat you fair and square, and I want to prove that I am the true and rightful NXT Women's Champion. Are you up for the challenge? Watch out! Tiffany Stratton just blindsided Lyra from behind. The aggression we've seen from Stratton is on full display. Tiffany Stratton wasting no time making a statement here. Lyra never saw it coming. It's clear that Stratton is sending a message not only to Lyra, but to the entire NXT women's division. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WWE Fastlane, and what a night we have ahead. I'm Michael Cole, alongside Corey Graves. And Corey, we've got a heated rivalry coming to a head right now. That's right, Cole. Piper Niven has been on an absolute tear, leaving a path of destruction in her wake. The SmackDown locker room has felt the wrath, and tonight, Valkyrie steps up to put an end to Piper's reign of terror. And here she is, ladies and gentlemen. Valkyrie, the embodiment of courage and determination, making her way to the ring. Listen to this crowd, Corey. They are firmly behind Valkyrie. Absolutely, Cole. The WWE Universe knows what's at stake in this match, and they're rallying behind Valkyrie, hoping she can put an end to Piper Niven's reign of terror. Valkyrie with a powerful presence, walking down that ramp with purpose. You can feel the energy in the arena. The fans here are ready for a fight. And here we go, the bell is rung, and Piper Niven wasting no time, immediately taking control of this match. Piper showcasing her incredible strength right from the start, Cole. Those powerful slams are just a taste of what Valkyrie is up against tonight. It's like watching a wrecking ball in action, Corey. Valkyrie struggling to find her footing as Piper dominates with pure raw power. Piper Niven has been, in, has been a force to be reckoned with and it's on full display here. Valkyrie needs to come up with a game plan, and this could be a short night for her. Valkyrie desperately trying to fight back, but every attempt seems to be thwarted by Piper's sheer strength. It's like trying to move a mountain. Wait a minute, Valkyrie's showing incredible resilience. She's mounting a comeback. That knee strike came out of nowhere. Valkyrie is digging deep, finding that second win we've seen from her before. That's the heart of a warrior goal. Valkyrie refusing to back down in the face of Piper Niven's onslaught. Valkyrie with a glimmer of hope, and now she's setting up for her finisher, the Angel Serenity. The crowd on their feet, but wait, Piper kicks out. Piper Niven showing incredible resilience of her own. Unbelievable Cole. Valkyrie threw everything she had at Piper, but the powerhouse is still ill in this, in this match. Hey. Piper Niven looking to regain control. She's going for her finisher. But wait, Valkyrie with a counter. She's not ready to be put away just yet. Piper still tosses her around like a rag doll, though. What an insane show of strength. And now Piper takes this fight to the outside. We've seen this before, Corey. She's got that sinister plan in mind. Piper has been a wrecking ball on the outside, especially with that announcer table. She's looking to do some serious damage. Wait a minute, Valkyrie with an incredible counter. Piper Niven had bad intentions with that table, but Valkyrie had other plans. This is why Valkyrie has become a fan favorite, Cole. She's resilient, she's smart, and she can turn the tables in an instant. Oh my, look at this. Valkyrie placing Piper on the announcer table, and she's climbing the ropes. The WWE Universe is on its feet. Valkyrie with a moonsault. She crashes through Piper Niven and the table. What a spectacle. And there it is. Valkyrie secures the victory with that incredible moonsault through the table. What a statement. Valkyrie not only survives Piper Niven's onslaught, but turns the tables with that jaw-dropping maneuver. Fastlane has delivered once again, and Valkyrie has proven she might just have her place in the SmackDown women's division. 
Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Fastlane. And what a matchup we have for you tonight. The World Women's Championship is on the line. And the imposing Jade Cargill is set to challenge the champion, Alexa Bliss. Uh, that's right, Cole. Uh, Jade Cargill has been a force to be reckoned with since her arrival at the Survivor Series. She was the sole survivor. And tonight could be the night she adds championship gold to her resume. The question on everyone's mind, Corey, is can Alexa Bliss overcome the sheer power and intimidation that Jade Cargill brings to the table? And here we go. The Women's World Championship is on the line as Alexa Bliss, the champion, steps into the ring against the dominant force, Jade Cargill. This is a classic case of power versus cunning graves. Alexa Bliss relying on her unorthodox methods and Jade Cargill simply relying on raw power. Thus far, this has been an absolute display of dominance by Jade Cargill here at Fastlane. She has completely taken control of this Women's World Championship match against Alexa Bliss. Thus far, this is, has been an absolute display of dominance by Jade Cargill here at Fastlane. She has completely taken control of this Women's World Championship match against Alexa Bliss. Every slam, every strike, it's as if Jade Cargill is on a mission to prove a point. This is an absolute mauling. And it's not just the physicality, it's the psychological aspect too. Bliss's mind games haven't worked, and now she's paying the price. I have, I've said it before, Cole, all right? Jade Cargill is a game changer. She's, she's uh, dismantling Bliss with absolute ease. It's been all Jade Cargill from the get-go. Alexa Bliss can't seem to find an answer. And now she is looking to put the champion away and become the next title holder. The champion looks like she's run out of tricks. This is a clinic in domination. That slam could be the exclamation point, Corey. Bliss might be on the verge of losing her championship. And a kick out. I don't even know how Alexa kicked out of that one. Oh, things have taken a turn here at Fastlane. The referee accidentally caught in the crossfire. And now Alexa Bliss was looking for that equalizer in the form of a steel chair. And just like that, Jade Cargill thwarting Bliss's attempt to introduce a steel chair into this match. It, it's like Jade has an answer for everything, Cole. Bliss can't catch a break. Uh, wait a minute. The referee believes Jade used the steel chair on Alexa Bliss. We could be looking at a disqualification here. This is a disaster for Jade Cargill. She had this match firmly in her grasp. Alexa Bliss is pretending to be hurt, but look at that smirk, Corey. She's playing mind games even with the official. This is the brilliance of Alexa Bliss. Cole, she uh, might not have the physical dominance of Jade Cargill, but her psychological warfare is unmatched. Regardless of how you feel about it, Corey, the record books will show a disqualification win for Alexa Bliss. What does this mean for the Women's World Championship? It means, Cole, that Alexa Bliss retains the title and Jade Cargill is left seething with frustration. Fastlane has left us with more questions than answers, Corey. What a night. Oh no, this is taking a dangerous turn. Jade Cargill, frustrated and rightfully so, has just attacked the referee. Uh, you can feel the anger radiating off Jade, Cole, but attacking the official is not the answer. This is a volatile situation, Corey. We understand Jade's frustration with the referee's decision, but this is not how you handle it. It's a costly mistake, Cole. She might have just jeopardized her standing in the WWE. The referee is down, and this is going to have consequences for Jade Cargill. You can't lay your hands on a WWE official. Absolutely, Cole. Uh, this could lead to a suspension, or worse, a hefty fine. This is a regrettable scene here at Fastlane. Jade Cargill has let her frustration get the better of her Wait a minute, what's happening here? Bianca Belair is storming the ring from behind. Bianca Belair making a statement here at Fastlane. She's got some unfinished business with Alexa Bliss. Last week she found out Alexa was behind her attack at Money in the Bank. And now she wants her revenge on the goddess. This is a clear declaration, Cole. Bianca is coming for that title. Bianca Belair has just changed the landscape of the women's division. And she's not leaving without making a statement. Fastlane is living up to its name, Cole. The road to WrestleMania just got a whole lot you know, more interesting for Alexa Bliss and uh, Bianca Belair.